What's up, FHS? It's Friday the 13th of November. I'm Brooke Miller, and this is Night's Watch. For lunch today, your choices are crispito, toasted ravioli with cheese, mini corn dogs, ham and cheese sandwich, and salad bar. BKTV would like to wish a happy birthday today to Jack Tony. Celebrating birthdays this weekend are Bella Herman, Jaden Wood, Ryan Barnes, Hannah Hatfield, Tyreek Parrott, Ryan Hunt, and Zabian Gusman. Happy birthday from BKTV, and don't forget to get your birthday selfie with Dr. Lamont. There is an FBLA meeting in room 109 today during seminar. On November 17th, World Prematurity Day, March of Dimes, shines a light on the global crisis of prematurity. Join FBLA for, to, fight for family, for, to fight for every family by donating. Okay. On November 17th, World Prematurity Day, March of Dimes, shines a light on global crisis of prematurity. Join FBLA to fight for every family by donating and participating in all school penny war between each grade level. All money will be donated to support life, saving research, and community-based programs to improve the health of mom and babies. During the week of November 16th through November 20th, FBLA will be hosting our annual class Penny Wars. Before school and during each lunch period, there will be jars set out for each grade level. Pennies count towards the grade level, but silver counts against the grade level. May the best grade level win. Super Nights will be raffling off a set of cornhole boards. The tickets can be purchased from Brandy Marler. The tickets are $5 a ticket and only 75 will be sold. All of the money collected will be used to adopt a family for Christmas. I'm Austin Ketcherside. If you're interested in joining the FHS math team this year, please email Miss Samantha Campbell by November 20th so she can get you more information. Don't forget to bring in your change for the Wounded Warrior Fundraiser sponsored by the FCCLA. Each week for the next two weeks, a winning hallway will be awarded a popcorn party. The Farmington Jazz Festival is Monday, November 23rd at the Centene Center starting at 6 p.m. Tickets cost $3 for adults and $2 for school-aged children. In sporting news, the football team will travel. In sporting news, the football team will travel to Jackson today for the next round of district play. There are a limited number of game vouchers available in the front desk lobby. You must have a voucher to and pay your entrance fee to get into the game at Jackson. Good luck to the Knights. Hi, I'm Roland Tischer. In college and career updates, on Wednesday, November 18th, there will be a representative from the University of Northern Iowa to meet with students. Sign up if you are interested in meeting with the representatives. The next available date to take the ACT exam is December 12th. The deadline to register with no late fees is November 20th. Visit ACT.org for no more information. FHS will be holding a free ACT review on Thursday, December 10th after school in room 109 from 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. Please sign up in the form in the description below if you're interested. I'm Caleb Truman, and Mineral Area College waive reading scores for the fall 2020 semester only. If you do not have an AccuPlacer reading score of 250 or higher on file with us, or an ACT reading section subscore of 18 or higher, you will not be eligible to take cor courses like Western Civ II, Public Speaking, Psychology, Sociology, American Political Systems, World Religions, and a few other courses through Mineral Area College during Spring 2021 term. Please click the link in the description below to see what test scores are needed for courses you are planning on taking for the Spring 2021 semester. Please sign up below to take the AccuPlacer during 6th sixth or 7th hour at FHS in LMC Computer Lab 2. Report directly to the LMC Computer Lab for the time that you sign up. The cost of the AccuPlacer test is $10, $10 for one subject test, $15 for two subject tests, and $20 for three subject tests. If you have any questions, please email Dr. Brian Reeves. That's it for this episode of Night's Watch. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell for notifications.